So those who have looked carefully at the digestive tract, you find out that there's somewhere in the digestive tract known as a pylorus. Okay, sorry, my bad, I didn't bring any picture that actually shows a pylorus. So if you say something is transpyloric, that means there's a line that is passing through the pylorus area. Okay, so this is the line that we are trying to talk about. It's an important medical imaginary line, okay, that, will I say, is in between the abdomen and thorax. Okay, so we we'll talk about this line from the definition. We we'll get to see it on pictures. We we'll talk about the significance and its importance, right? So for the definition, this is the line we are talking about transpyloric so deep down here is where you find the, the pylorus which is where the stomach is joining to the small intestine right so say so that the pyloric line is an imaginary horizontal line that passes through the pylorus now the pylorus is the region of the stomach that connects to the small intestine okay this line is also used as a reference point in anatomy and surgery Okay, it's a very important line. A lot of structures lie below this line. That's why we study it. The significance, it demarcates the border between the stomach and the small intestine. It is at the pylorus where the stomach is joining to the small intestine, right? It marks the first level of the first lumbar vertebrae. That's where you are looking at the back from the spinal cord. That's where L1 starts from. It serves as a reference point for gastric surgery abdominal organ localization and imaging studies like CT scan, right? It also helps you to identify structures such as what? Dodenum, pancreas, hepatic portal vein, and celiac trunk. You can be able to use the pylorus to actually what? Identify any of these structures in the abdomen. So, I think we've spoken about the significance, more of like the importance, but they actually put out some importance again, all right? For gastric resection, of course, you know where to cut the stomach from, okay? If you want to preserve or if you want to use the transpyloric line as a reference point, okay? It serves as a, a, a marker for WIPU procedure, which is the pancreato, pan, pancreatico duodenectomy. okay? It also... um. Well, I say it helps in abdominal trauma surgery. It also helps in what uh, directing what diagnostic imaging studies. Okay, so as you are moving the probe, maybe you are as you, as you want to position the person. Maybe there's something that you want to now target. Okay, so now I now use the transpyloric line as a calculation reference point. Okay, so I think that's just the this line, or it's a transpyloric line or transpyloric plane, and it's applications in medicine.